Just let me sting a little. Sorry. <clears throat> it wasn't a shot. It's, um... My head's killing me. Well, Senator, we don't have to do this now. You can hold off till your HIV test comes back. <laughs> I guess you figure it's gonna come back positive. In my experience... Patients lie. Politicians lie more. And black politicians... <laughs> I don't think black politicians lie more than white politicians. We lie less. You figure we're morally superior? <laughs> I've got my theories. <laughs> no, we... We just can't get away with it. <clears throat> no one's gonna... Give us the benefit of the doubt. No one's gonna cut us a second chance. And, and when it happens, it's not just a... A bad politician. It's, it's, it's a bad role model. It's a... A uh, dis... dis... credit to the race. <sighs> you ready? Yeah. Yeah. Talk to you, brother. <sighs> T-cell count is eight, which means there's a good chance you'll die. I'm telling you this because we need to contact your sexual partners. I've only had two girlfriends. Two. After my wife died. I used condoms. You know the chances of you getting HIV from heterosexual sex with a condom? Yes. Someday there will be a black president. Someday there will be a gay president. Maybe there'll even be a gay black president. The one combination I do not see happening is gay, black, and dead. You need to stop lying to me. It must be miserable. Always assuming the worst in people. Oh, cut the crap. You're dying. And you're clever. You're witty. And you are a coward. You're scared of taking chances. I take chances all the time. It's one of my worst qualities. On people? Wanting to believe the best about people doesn't make it true. Being afraid to believe it doesn't make it false. Well, that's very moving. It's a shame I don't vote. No, no, no. <laughs> this is who I am. I believe in people. I'm not hipply cynical and I don't make easy, snide remarks. I would rather think that people are good and be disappointed once and again. Antiretrovirals aren't working. Why not? Because you don't have AIDS. <laughs> First test was a false positive. Happens one time in every 5,000. You r ran a second test? Yeah. yeah. You're still dying. The only difference is now we don't know why.
continuing to lose control of the muscles on his right side. His brain is getting foggier and his T-cells are still in single digits. Why are we doing this here? So Cuddy can't find us. Unless we figure out the underlying disease, this guy's lied to his last constituent. False negative on the PCR AIDS test? Ran it twice. Immunoglobulin deficiency? No history of respiratory problems. Idiopathic T-cell deficiency. Idiopathic from the Latin meaning we're idiots because we can't figure out what's causing it. Give him a whole body scan. You hate whole body scans. Because they're useless. Probably scan every one of us and find five different doodads that look like cancer. What? When you're fourth down and 100 to go in the snow, you don't call a running play up the middle unless you're the Jets. I hate sports metaphors. Why did you order the second AIDS test? Lie to me. <laughs> okay, it'll uh, feel like a gentle massage. House is a lousy teacher. You can't lie for beans. Have you ever told any really big ones? Oh, ho, 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 ho. I might be messed up, but I'm not that out of it. Mm. Mm. Drop his arm down. Mm. 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 Am I gonna be okay? I hope so. Kidney and liver cysts are both benign, and lymph nodes all came back clean. His left armpit node has antibodies for CD11. Well, not enough to indicate lymphoma. Never tested for hairy cell leukemia. No, we would have picked it up somewhere else besides one lymph node. And his spleen isn't enlarged. Size isn't everything. And the spleen is the mother load for hairy cells. Let's cut it open. You can't biopsy his spleen. It'll bleed like steak. In the senator's condition, a spleen biopsy could easily cause sepsis and kill him. Why do you do this to me? Now, if I kill him, I can't tell the judge I had no idea of the risks involved. His brain is turning into mush, and he's at risk for more infections. We have to do it. See, that don't sound much better in court. OK, go tell our human pin cushion we'll be sticking him one more time. Cuddy. Don't you hate doing this? Yeah. Hey, Senator. We need to do one more biopsy. On your spleen. <clears throat> I have to sign left see my fingers are working. Does it hurt? It's like I can't get air <coughs> from the castle. No. This is this is new. You don't need to sign. We can't do the biopsy. <coughs>